What is up? My name is Greg. My name is Greg! Ah! And today I'm drawing Lara Croft from Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider is 25 years old and to commemorate the 25th anniversary, I'm gonna draw her in her natural habitat. Well, as close to a natural habitat as we can get in Chicago. So we're here to get inspiration, some nice reference photos. I think that's about it. Yes, we're gonna give Lara Croft a home here in Chicago. Let's go. Yeah, when I got back from the Forest Preserve, I had a number of different photos to choose from and I ended up on this photo of the river and a structure on top. I think it's like railroad tracks or something. And this little outlet of land where I thought I could insert Laura Croft right on there. I thought it'd be really cool and I could insert some ruins so that it looks like she's going on an adventure. When I was a kid, I didn't really play any of the Tomb Raider games. I wasn't all that interested, but my best friend who lived five houses away loved Tomb Raider. So I'd always watch him play pretty much all the Tomb Raider games because he'd buy it. So it was always in the background of my childhood. And I remember one time specifically, uh, he came over and he's like, hey, do you want to watch the... Tomb Raider movie. It was summer and it was the one with Angelina Jolie. I think it was like June or something. I was like, sure, let's go watch it. I don't remember any of the plot or what was going on, but I remember watching it. Uh, so that was the extent of my experience with Tomb Raider, really. Um, I mean, I'd see her every once in a while with a new game, like in the past five to ten years. I know they rebooted the trilogy, but uh, it wasn't something that I was all that interested in. Uh, during this quarantine, though, I started playing the reboot trilogy. So the Tomb Raider, Rise of the Tomb Raider, and Shadow of the Tomb Raider. Um, I've gotten through two of those games, and I'm at the last part of Shadow of the Tomb Raider. I've gotten much more familiar with the games. And I'm honestly pretty happy with what they've done with it. It was definitely created with what you would call in the art world with a male gaze. Um, and I think these last games that they've created is much more uh, nuanced and with created with a more diverse perspective, not as sexualized, which I really appreciate. I mean, when I think about the games that I've enjoyed, the most like enjoyed watching the most in the past like 10 years or playing the most is like last of us and last of us has a strong female lead and i think it's worth noting uh, to say that laura croft was one of the first female main characters where you couldn't switch from male or female like exclusively female characters to reach the mainstream there really wasn't anything before that um, to my knowledge, uh, you know, like I'm not a game historian or anything, but I can't think of anything else. Yeah, and I think it paves the way for a lot of other female lead characters. Well, anyways, let's go back to the painting. I could have done a little bit better. I could have spent a little bit more time on it, but honestly, we were running out of sunlight and my lighting isn't very good in my apartment, so I had to put it at a stop there, and I was taking up the entire dinner table, um, so I couldn't work on it more than a couple days without completely changing the camera view. So this is what you're getting. I had a lot of fun with this. Uh, I always have fun with watercolor. I know a lot of people have trouble with it, but I really don't put that much pressure on myself while I'm making watercolor. It's just fun. It's a very cathartic, relaxing process for me. Um, I highly recommend you just go and take a walk, take reference photos for yourself, and make art from it. It's definitely something that I'm going to do from here on out. All right. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace!
Do you feel like you're ready to embody Lara Croft? She does that, right?